Hi, this is going to be a reading for Gemini for June. I'm going to start with Gemini because they didn't even get one last month, so I'm really going to put some care into this reading for my Gemini friends, Sun, Moon, and Rising. It's the Everyday Witch Tarot. Gemini, what's been going on? I feel like everything is shifting for you. I wasn't even, Spirit kind of blocked me from doing the Gemini reading last month, so I don't know what the deal was. It's like my advice was not allowed. You had to figure it out for yourself. I don't know. I don't have no idea why. Tower moment. There was like a big tower moment for a lot of you. Some shocking revelation. Big reveal I was not supposed to tell you, you know, before it happened. Um, that's putting you now into a three of wands kind of pause wait energy. What did I just say? The tower. The tower just happened for you. Something is totally... If it didn't happen, it's right about to, man. In June, this is going to be a major transformation. Your whole life's going to look different in a couple months. Um, that's going to put you in, again, a hanged man. Another waiting energy. So it's some waiting. Then there's, like, everything changes. And then you have to go within and really seek stability within yourself. Really ask yourself what you want, who you are. You know, those deeper questions. Um, a lot of you are coming into an emperor energy. If this is not you... This means that you're going to meet your emperor um, or reunite with your emperor. That could be the shocking plot twist that you didn't see coming. Or some of you are elevating to the status, okay? Um, Eight of Pentacles is focused on your work. So a lot of you are taking charge of leadership roles at work. Um, but there's some spying energy here. I want to know more about this. Uh, justice is coming to some some overthinking I feel some betrayal something that really disappointed you and you're like still looking out um, at that opportunity but listen you were not meant that was not meant for you because you're meant for something better and something bigger justice is coming the skills are going to be balanced you you don't see everything you see how she's her eyes are almost completely covered <clears throat> she doesn't see everything she has to trust her intuition here God sees it all so he's protecting you by that missed opportunity whatever it was focus on your passions at this time spirit saying because uh, you're about to have a new beginning a new commitment that's going to bring you healing because i see the fool the star and the hierophant here so it's it could be a, <clears throat> a teaching role or some sort of hobby you're going to pursue but something that's a something completely new and different from what you're currently doing be careful uh, to plan ahead because you see how she's about to walk off the cliff here uh, watch where you're going as best you can. Trust yourself. Trust the gut feelings you have. Uh, get a, get away from some sort of situation. There's a moving away secretly because it's the moon here. So there's a kind of a shift in energy, but not everything is completely out in the open right now. You're having the patience to balance out your life at this time, which is good. A lot of pause energy in June for you. It is your season right now, but you'd <clears throat> you feel stuck. Mercury retrogrades until the 2nd of June, so that's going to have a little hangover that first week. And then you should feel, your throat chakra should feel more freed up. <clears throat> Again, tune into your intuition. In order to free yourself, um, she can easily get out of this, okay? There's just eight swords in the ground. And she could just shimmy out of that situation <laughs> like pretty easily. You trust yourself. It's not as bad as you think. Your, you know, your thoughts are your own worst enemy sometimes. You're going to have the victory of the Queen of Wands. As soon as you tune into your passions and follow the path that your heart's telling you to go down. Um, to follow your heart at Queen of Wands. Queen of well, Wands again, but Queen of Cups. Give back to others when you can. In June. Tune into your heart chakra. Um, if you have rose quartz, I would carry that around. If you don't, it might be time to invest in some. It's going to heal that heartbreak. It's going to help start open, <clears throat> opening your heart again from that past pain so you can forgive yourself and others um, and tune into what you should do next okay love you so much gemini peace out